Do you know what it's like to be locked in an edaphic uh, torture dungeon where you can learn how soil composition and geology influence plant life? Do you know what that's like? Because I could show you what that's like. Because over there, that mountain, that little mesa over there, is the igneous alluvial uh, deposits. And we've left that, and now we have returned once again to the calcareous marine sediments uh, of the Bokeas Formation, laid down in an ancient Cretaceous Sea, a late Cretaceous Sea. What's this? Is this, uh, what is it? It's probably just gypsum, selenite. Could make some sheetrock out of that. These crystals, I, I, they do appear to just be selenite. They're still interesting nonetheless. Got a Corophanta agave lechuguillas going off. Got some rednecks over there shooting off shotguns because, uh, that's what simpletons do for fun. <gasps> Euphorbia anti-syphilitica. Oh my god. Doesn't cure syphilis, but it sure looks nice. Used in uh, candle making and soap. What else we got over here? We got the Selaginellas. The Selaginellas, the resurrection ferns. All dried out, but not dead. Ready to come back at any moment like a washed up 80s pop star. What else we got going on nice? Oh, <gasps> a kind of serious daisy acanthus. The Texas rainbow cactus. Does Texas even have rainbows? No, but it sure does have an abundance of private land and assholes. What else we got going on here? Actually, speaking of private land and assholes, there's a 300,000 acre public uh, state park just west of here that they shut down for an entire week. So that a couple uh, guys, I think 12 at the most, but uh, as of yesterday, there was only one guy there. The entire park is shut down so one guy can shoot birds. You know, I think the hunting lobby had that written into the contract when they made the transfer of the 300,000 acres of land to the public, to the state. They said, we'll only transfer this to you if you're willing to do something dickish like shut the entire state park down for a week so a couple guys can go in there and shoot birds. A lot of fossils in these rocks, too. I guess they recovered a uh, some sort of marine lizard. Oh, what is this? This thing, I don't know what this is yet. I don't know if it's a euphorb or what. Seen a big one back there where I seen the javelinas that had a nice red red fruit on it. Jelly red fruit. Okay, I think my uh, traveling companion's mad at me. I gotta stop doing it. I gotta get off. <gasps> Look, this is grandma. Grandma grass. Not grandma as in G R A N D M A, but grandma as in G R A M M A. You can always tell it's grandma because it's got those little eyebrows. Nice. Would this thing focus for me? There you go. 